How do you clean a badly stained RV awning? After this video, you will never use a brush or pressure washer or harsh chemicals to clean your awning. I had so much fun cleaning our awning with this dollar hack, I had to share it. Let's get started. We've been RVing for over 10 years and all the people on YouTube are doing it wrong. Sorry, we don't have a more professional video, but I just had so much fun cleaning the awning, I decided at the last minute to share our easy, simple hack. I think the RV products companies are going to hate me for this because you don't need special chemicals or detergents. First, I'll tell you all the ways we use to clean the awning, then we'll share with you the process that makes me look forward to our new, easy way to make our awning bright white and super clean. But don't skip and follow every step as I don't know if you will get the same results otherwise. We've tried a few ways to clean our RV awning. We've used brushes, sponges, and pressure washers. The awning is flexible so you can't brush hard enough to get the mold off. We've tried different detergents from the RV companies, bleach, and other chemicals, but those are corrosive and can harm you and your RV. You have to be careful with pressure washers because you can damage your RV if you don't do it right. None of these options seemed to work well and they were all difficult. But worst of all, cleaning the awning wasn't fun. Next, let's discuss the process of cleaning the awning as I don't know if it will work as good for you if you don't follow every step detailed next. Yesterday my wife came up with an idea and shared it with me and I gave it a try. I'd try anything to clean this awning in a better way. What is the best way to clean an RV awning? I filled a small bucket with hot water and our normal RV wash and wax. Then I grabbed some sunglasses to protect my eyes from the sun and soapy, dirty water. Then I hosed down the underside of the awning. But you'll want a hot day, as I haven't found a way to wash the underside of the awning without getting wet. This is why bleach is a bad idea. In addition to ruining your awning, you have to be under the awning to clean it. Who wants corrosive chemicals raining on them? Anyway, with your sponge, we'll share what kind in a minute. Wipe the underside of the awning softly to remove the mold and mildew. For tougher stains, wipe a little harder. Not too hard though as we rub the paint off the top side of the awning. This is supposed to be easy. Don't rub hard, you don't need to. Rinse with a hose often and be careful on your ladder. Sponge any spots you may have missed and rinse again. What is the biggest pain for you when caring for your RV? Let us know in the comments, we'd love to hear from you. Stay until the end to see how we clean the top of the awning. The sponge she shared with me is none other than Mr. Clean Magic Eraser. One eraser cleaned the whole awning and it was super easy. If you don't want to use a ladder, stay until the end for two other products that could be even better. So do you know someone who will want to try this too? Share this video because I don't think your friends will see it unless you do. You don't want to keep the secret to yourself, do you? How do you clean the top of your RV awning? To clean the top of the awning, we start at the bottom and work our way up. We have a power awning which makes it easier but clean what you can with your sponge and rinse with your hose, then roll the awning up a couple of feet and clean another run and rinse. Move the awning again and maybe another time to finish cleaning the top. Rinsing the awning is so satisfying, don't you think? When you are done, extend the awning fully and rinse the top and bottom one more time, then let the awning air dry. So, what is the best thing to use to clean the awning? The best thing to use to clean an awning is Magic Eraser and Soapy Water. But I keep thinking some of you don't like ladders. If you would rather stay off the ladder, the Mr. Clean Magic Eraser Squeeze Mop and Roller Mop are great alternatives. We'll put links in our description so you know the exact products we're talking about. If you are looking for a good sewer hose comparison, watch this video next.